How are we all? Ben here. So uh, I'm just going to show you how to uh, propagate some of Euonymus. Uh, I find Euonymus to be like one of the harder, uh, easiest plants to propagate. Little dogs coming in for some uh, gardening as well. So basically what you want to do is you want to take cuttings from anywhere from about 2 to 3 inch of Euonymus. Um, I've got four different cuttings here. I believe this is the golden variety, I'm not too sure, it might be the other other variety, but they all work just the same. So what you want to be doing is you want to be taking off the first couple leaves, you're going to be leaving a few at the top, and you're going to be planting your plant in where these leaf nodes are. So I'm just going to quickly cut these, um, I'll try and position my phone so you can see at the same time, that, because I'm not about to try to put it Right, there you go, look. So you won't be getting your secateurs, or you just won't be ripping them off. So you just won't be cutting the bottom couple of uh, leaf nodes off. I call them leaf nodes, whether or not they're called leaf nodes or not. I have absolutely no idea. So cut them off like that. So you want to be coming out with something like this final product so you've got your cut in and you can see where the old leaves were as well so what you want to do is you want to get some nice compost normally use grocery or something like that um, this stuff's from the tip at the moment i've treated it myself because it was quite strong it was killing off a lot of saplings so you want to just make sure that this is nice and firm fill the pot up as much as you can nice and firm so it's not loose you want to just create an incision like a little diddy hole in the middle of the pot. Now, I would recommend rooting powder, but you don't have to use rooting powder. I'm not going to be using rooting powder in this instant, but normally you just cover the whole base of the stem up to these leaf nodes in rooting powder. So you just want to literally do that. I'm going to make it as firm as you can around the base. And then you want to keep in partial sunlight and get a sprayer bottle and just keep spraying it as regularly as possible uh, what i normally do is i keep it in like a little tray so as you can see loads of other cuttings this year um, that are taken quite nicely a mixed variety budley as you want all, all that good shit I've got a few saplings on the go there as well but like i say it's just literally keeping them in a tray and you can keep filling them up with water and like I say it's just some sunlight partial sunlight and obviously like I say if you've got a sprayer bottle there's my rooting powder look you want to just give everything just a light spray and then just keep on top of it like that and over a few weeks it should take and, and hopefully start to uh, show new life uh, this is one I've had now potted for a few weeks now and it's started to grow and it's it's set lovely so I mean, it's, it's trial and error with um, propagation, but literally what you've seen me do there, that should hopefully take now. I would recommend rooting powder, but um, if, obviously, if you, especially if you're first starting off as well. But other than that, it's as simple as that. You literally just get your cut in, cut it at the bottom, cut it at an angle, cut your bottom leaf nodes off, and obviously stick it in the ground like that. So it's as simple as that. But anyway, if any of you guys have found this video helpful, I've done my job, so that's all I care about. Have a good one, guys.